The Leukemia Research Foundation is fortunate to be surrounded by a pool of scientists rich in knowledge and experience. Often the medical professionals who support the mission of the LRF have firsthand experience working with the foundation. This is true of the chairman of the Medical Advisory Board, Dr. John Crispino. Dr. Crispino recently completed his first year as chair of the LRF's Medical Advisory Board. An associate professor, Division of Hematology Oncology at Northwestern University's Feinberg School of Medicine, Dr. Crispino's lab is focused on investigating the regulatory mechanisms governing normal and malignant blood cell development. He received his bachelor's degree at Washington University, PhD from Massachusetts Institute of Technology, and fellowship training at Harvard Medical School. He has also served on the LRF's Medical Advisory Board since 2003. This past June, Dr. Crispino gathered members of the Foundation's Medical Advisory Board from around the country to review dozens of grant applications. Please welcome Dr. John Crispino. Great. Th uh, thanks, Diana. Uh, let me just start by saying what a great pleasure it is here to be here today and how inspirational it's been. Uh, those of us who work in laboratories tend to get locked away in the labs, focused on experiments and, and crucial results, and oftentimes we forget about the motivation for, for what, we're, what we're doing, and it's, it's, it's delightful and important to see firsthand uh, how important our research is to, to all of you and to the children and adults who suffer from these diseases. But let me say that there is hope to be optimistic, that there are thousands or tens of thousands of researchers throughout the world who are focused who spend every moment, uh, at least I do, I guess, almost every moment of every day thinking about how we can develop uh, better therapies, how we can better diagnose these diseases. Uh, and so as Diana mentioned this past June, 22 members of the Leukemia Research Foundation Medical Advisory Board met at Northwestern University and reviewed nearly 50 applications from new investigators who were looking for research support. Uh, we've decided several years ago to support researchers, researchers who are just finishing their fellowship training and are embarking in an independent career as a new professor, a new assistant professor somewhere in the world. And this is a very vulnerable time for these investigators. It's crucial that they receive support to, to enable them to foster their new develop, development of new ideas, innovative approaches to therapies and diagnosis. We selected eight individuals for funding. This was a very uh, interesting year. We had very, uh, a great number of international applications. And of the eight, we funded three uh, professors from other countries, including Canada, Israel, and India. But we also were able to fund one person in our own backyard, uh, Dr. Justin Klein from the University of Chicago, whose laboratory is pursuing innovative research to try to develop ways to have the body's own immune system better fight off uh, leukemia cells. So on behalf of the members of the Medical Advisory Board and the eight awardees, I'd like to thank all of you here for your commitment to supporting leukemia research, and I'm happy to accept the awards on their behalf. Thank you very much.